What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Roman and we've actually got two updates today. The first of which the official release date for Falcon in the Winter Soldier, making good on a report we had last week here at the channel. And it seems to be tied to this release of the WandaVision trailer and an update as far as the Investors Day meeting, perhaps an erroneous report, even though it came from Disney itself, that we're even gonna get this Investors Day meeting at all. And yesterday with the release of the WandaVision trailer, it did sort of make me scratch my head and say, why would you not just save this for said Investors Day meeting. Anyway, we're going to break down the brand new Falcon and Winter Soldier release date, talk about the WandaVision trailer and maybe the absence of this announcement from Marvel. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we're giving away two PlayStation 4 Pros, as well as a whole slew of other Marvel related stuff, including this insane one fourth scale XM Studios beta ray bill and this third and final Infinity Saga box set. If you want to be entered to win, all you have to do, hit the subscribe button, then hit the notification bell, leave a like and a comment on this video. And if you want, stick around at the end of the video we'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there so as we reported a couple of weeks here at the channel there was a rumor that falcon and the winter soldier would indeed be pushed back to 2021 and now as announced from disney plus itself if you go to your disney plus subscription click on marvel then the falcon and the winter soldier homepage you will clearly see it's indicated as coming out in 2021 and this makes good on not only the rumors and reports from the last couple of months but also disney's real recent action of changing all of the release dates everywhere on every platform to simply coming soon. Now, what's interesting about this, and we talked about this also at the channel, is that Black Widow is supposed to be introducing characters that tie right into the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. And if they're moving Falcon and the Winter Soldier back, what does that mean for Black Widow? And what about that Investor's Day meeting? There was an update today, as reported by the Direct.com, that what we reported on this Investor's Day meeting that had official graphics and an official announcement with times and everything was in no way an official post and has now been deleted, scratching our heads wondering if there'll be any more official Marvel announcements at all this year, considering none of us are real sure if Black Widow is still being released in theaters, and they went ahead and released a WandaVision trailer that didn't give us a certain release date. I gotta be honest with you guys, I'm also scratching my head as to what Marvel Studios is exactly doing. I keep making the excuse for them that they don't want to go ahead and make any more announcements and then have to change them again, but it has been quite a while since we've heard anything from them and I thought there was no way they were going to give us a trailer without a release date. Everybody's asking, what's up with these Disney Plus shows? Everybody wants to get a subscription, doesn't want to get one too early. I have no idea why Marvel is playing this coy and not giving us anything in the way of a release date for any of these TV shows. Again, a trailer for WandaVision with no release date weekend. You would think while the excitement was high, you'd want to go ahead and cash in on that and not drag it out. And they have to know we all have a ton of questions. We'll have to see. No Investors Day meeting aside, maybe Marvel will make some more official announcements this year, but it's hard to tell where they would do that with no D23 and all the virtual Comic Cons passed already. Guys, let me know all your thoughts down below. Are you also just a little frustrated with how Marvel hasn't made any official announcements? Do you still think that Black Widow is coming out this November? And do you also think WandaVision may come any earlier than December? Maybe you've seen the rumors Thanksgiving weekend could be it as soon as The Mandalorian finishes. Again, only time will tell. Guys, let me know what you're thinking about all of this, your thoughts and feedbacks as far as Marvel Studios and the WandaVision trailer. Also, make sure to check out the WandaVision Easter eggs we did at the end of this talking about the possible villain. And quickly, let's get into the giveaway stuff before I let you go. We're still giving away two places. PlayStation 4 Pros, as well as this insane one fourth scale XM Studios Beta Ray Bill and our third and final Infinity Saga box set. If you want to be entered to win, all you have to do, hit the subscribe button, then hit the notification bell, leave a like and a comment on this video. And because it's truly random, the more videos you leave a like and comment on, the better chance you have of winning. All winners will be chosen at random and announced at the end of the videos the same way we're doing here. And if you've missed any of the previous winner announcements, no worries, all you have to do, scroll back through the channel, look for the winner announcement in the sub count in the title, click on that video and scroll to the end. My name is Michael Roman. This is Everything Always, guys. Thanks for checking out the channel and stick around. We'll be posting again real, real soon.